pretty straightforward. She started Dhuhr prayer, and while she was praying Dhuhr, she remembered that she missed Fajr. So can she change her intention to make that prayer Fajr? Or should she continue with her prayer? The answer is she must continue with her prayer, finish Dhuhr Arba, four rak'ahs, and then pray two uh, rak'ahs of Fajr. Because if she changed her intention within the prayer, she would not be praying neither Fajr nor Dhuhr. Both would be nullified and she would, it would be considered for her voluntary prayer. So Alhamdulillah, due to forgetfulness, as long as she started praying Dhuhr, she should continue to pray Dhuhr and then pray Fajr afterwards. The order is mandatory. This is without any doubt. But this obligation falls when you are ignorant or when you have forgotten, as in the case of uh, Sister Nadia. Her second question is very usual. People get this. Someone comes to me and asks for a loan for three months. I have the money and I can give him, but I have bad experience with this person of, uh, or I heard few people complaining that he borrows and does not give back. So am I sinful if I don't give him? The answer is no. Lending people is not an obligation. It's not mandatory. Even if you have money, it's something that is highly recommended. The reward is so enormous, it is unbelievable. If you lend someone, let's say 5,000 riyals for a month and he gives it back and then he borrows another 5,000 riyals for any given period, a month or a week or so, and he gives it back, you have the 5,000 in your pocket, Allah Azza wa Jal would reward you as if you given for charity 5,000 riyals because you lent it twice. And if you give a person 5,000 riyals and you give him a date and he doesn't pay it back and asks for uh, 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 an extension and you give him another month and again he doesn't pay it back, Allah would give it to you as if you have given 5,000 for charity. And if, he, if you set a third date for him and he doesn't give it back, for each day Allah would give you 5,000 riyals as charity. No investment in the world can give you this uh, a profit. Nowhere. So lending people is good, but throwing your money in the dustbin is not good. So you have to know where you give your money or who you give your money 